Hey guys, welcome to stop number six. Are we at six right now, Vanessa? A six, oh my goodness, yeah. Tweet for Toys continues going on strong. Uh, we're at Golden Gardens right now. Kim is the director. Thank you for having us, Kim. Glad you guys could come. All right, so tell us, number one, tell us about Golden Gardens. Golden Gardens, we are an adult day center. We're open Monday through Friday. It's a cost-effective healthcare option for someone to bring their loved one here instead of leaving them at home. Gives them socialization, gets them out in the community as well as we have a nurse and um, CNAs on staff to care for them while they're here. Why did you decide to participate in Tweet for Toys? We have every year since I've, we've been open for 10 years, we have picked a family that we actually get gifts for and donate. We've done Christmas trees, things like that. And then this year we decided how could we even go further. And so we went with this program so that we could get more toys and touch more people that way. How many toys did you collect? I think we have 72. 72, that's pretty good. And who did they come from? All of the... The clients, staff, clients, the clients donated some money. Then we went out and purchased staff, and then family members as well, and the company itself. Did you tell them um, where the toys are going? Yes. yes. Isn't that fantastic? It is. It is, and they feel like they're giving back. Yeah. So. Yeah. Uh, I spoke to one of the one of the uh, the clients here, and she said this is the best day, uh, adult daycare center in all of, of Indianapolis. Course, of course, we are the largest in Indianapolis, and our what we focus on our niche, so to speak, is getting them out in the community. So we do an outing every day, Fantastic. and sometimes two outings. So we go to like Indians games. We go to everything. Isn't that good? So yeah, that's great. Kim, thank you very much for having us. Thank you for participating this year. Glad to. And look at all these toys, guys. Good stuff. Uh, the Indy Public Safety Foundation definitely getting a large amount of goods this year. Our next stop, by the way, coming up in just a little while.